In this video, let's talk about the difference between what about and how about. This is a question that I received from a student and it's a really great question. Of course, I'm Jennifer from j4senglish.com and this channel is dedicated to helping you sound like a fluent, confident, natural English speaker. Now, before we go any further, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell icon so you're notified every time I post a new lesson. Now, let's dive in with this video. In this video, let's talk about the difference between what about and how about. Both of these are going to be very useful in your vocabulary. Now, I want you to pay attention to the sentence structure of both of these as well, in addition to the meaning that I explain. First, let's talk about how about. How about is used to offer a suggestion. For example, let's say your friend asks you, what should we do tonight? And you can say, how about, and now we need a suggestion. How about we go to the movies? How about we go to the movies? So pay attention to the sentence structure. Notice, how about, then subject, verb in the present simple, and then your object. How about we go to the movies? Now, what about is used to offer an objection or to offer a restriction to a suggestion. You can think of it simply as a reason to prevent you from acting on the suggestion. So first of all, let's bring back our suggestion. How about we go to the movies? Now your friend wants to offer an objection or a reason why we shouldn't. And they could say, what about your meeting? What about your meeting? So they want you to think about your meeting and there's something about that meeting that would prevent you from going to the movies. So let's see that again. What should we do tonight? How about we go to the movies? What about your meeting? So notice, how about to introduce a suggestion and what about to offer an objection or to prevent you from acting on that suggestion. Now, we can use both how about and what about to offer a suggestion in one specific case, and that's when the suggestion is a noun, so just a noun. Let's look at an example. Let's say I ask you, what should we have for dinner tonight? Now, you're going to offer a noun, let's say, pizza. And you could say, how about pizza? Now, you could also say, what about pizza? In this case, both of them are used to offer a suggestion. We can only do that when it's followed by a noun. So I could say, how about we have pizza? How about, and then subject, verb in the present simple, and then your noun. How about we have pizza? Now, it doesn't sound right if you say, what about we have pizza? That sounds awkward, but if you just use the noun, then you can use both of them to offer a suggestion. How about pizza? What about pizza? Now, keep in mind that what about and a noun is also used to offer an objection or a reason to prevent you from acting on that suggestion. So technically, you could use both of them, what about and a noun, to offer a suggestion and a reason to prevent you, okay? Now, it's really just the context and the tone of voice that will make it clear if you're offering a suggestion or an objection. So let's see that in example. Again, I could say, what should we have for dinner? And you could say, how about pizza? So how about pizza? It's a suggestion, right? You can kind of hear it in my tone of voice. How about pizza? Now, let's say you wanna offer a limitation and you can say, what about the fish? Now notice my tone, it's a little bit lower, it's more concern in it. What about the fish? So notice, what about the fish? Here, I'm offering a reason to prevent us from having pizza. So maybe there's fish in the fridge 
and if we don't eat it tonight, it will go bad, okay? So that's the reason why we shouldn't have pizza and we should have fish. And you know it's a objection because the tone in my voice and the way I delivered it and the context as well. So now you need to take all of this information and practice it for yourself. So first, I'd like you to offer a suggestion using how about and a full sentence so you get comfortable with that sentence structure, okay? So let's say the question is, what should we do tonight? So I want you to offer a suggestion in the comments below using how about. What should we do tonight? How about now? I'm gonna ask the other question. What should we have for dinner? In this case, I want you to answer using both how about or what about and a noun. Both of them are the same, but I just want you to get comfortable using them. So put that in the comments as well to get lots of practice. If you found this video helpful, please hit the like button, share it with your friends, and of course, subscribe. Now before you go, make sure you head on over to my website, j4senglish.com, and download your free speaking guide. In this guide, I share six tips on how to speak English fluently and confidently. And until next time, happy studying. Awesome job using how about and what about. Both of these are going to help you sound really natural, just like a native speaker, but of course, they'll only sound natural if you're using them correctly. So review the video again and make sure you leave your examples in the comments to practice and get really comfortable with them. Awesome job, I'll see you in my next video. Bye.